So I woke up today and decided that I wanted to film an editorial fashion magazine, magazine, why did I just say magazine twice, photographer photo shoot by myself. Oh my god. I got this idea from Avery Ovard, if that's how you say her last name. I'm deeply sorry if I butchered that. I got up, took a shower, I put some makeup on, I tried to do something a little unique. I'm not wearing mascara. It's so quirky. Blow dried my hair. I picked out an outfit, which is this little fuzzy thing. It's a crop top. It's really cute. Made some avocado dip, which is actually guacamole. That's the actual name. I ate some guacamole. And then I went downstairs to where I thought I was going to do this photo shoot. It was this big, beautiful field that I have been eyeballing. Got down there and I realized, wow. There's literally not a single spot of shade. So I went ahead, scratched that, came back upstairs, filmed another video, and now we're here and I'm about to do an editorial magazine photo shoot in front of this white blanket. Let's get into it. <laughs> so I'm gonna be using my phone. I have, isn't that a beautiful phone? Yeah, I'm just gonna be using this self timer and I don't really know what I'm doing at all. The idea of this is I want to emphasize how big my hair is. I want my hair to literally be huge. Okay, so that just looks like a selfie. I need to do something to make it look like magazine-y. So to spice up the shoot, I got these flowers and I think this will help a lot. And I also downloaded an app called Focus. Mm, I'm not sure if I'm feeling this. I am very confused right now. Oh yes. I wonder what it would look like if I put all the flowers like around my head. Hopefully my cat won't destroy me. Kitty cat, please leave me alone. I look like a crazy person right now. <laughs> Taylor does not approve. The pictures aren't turning out that well, I don't think. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger? Coach! <laughs> please leave my hair alone. You can't be doing that. Okay, I got most of the shots that I really like inside, but I decided to go ahead and give my original spot an attempt. Also, I thought it was funny and worth noting that the moment I stepped outside, I saw a dog taking a crap and it just was perfect for a Vogue photo shoot mood, you know. I was really, really, really afraid of snakes being in the field, but luckily I didn't get bit by any. Also, I brought my skateboard for protection because I didn't want to get killed. I edited all of the photos in Lightroom and I made a preset called Magazine that I used on almost every single picture. These are some of the settings if you're interested. And then here's a before and after. I also made a second preset called Magazine 2 that I used on some as well. So here's a few before and afters, just so you can see the difference. 